love doing a bit of a vlog. I don't know if I'm ever actually going to upload it or if I'm just going to kind of keep it for myself. Might upload it at some point but I'm not too sure. So basically, Stephanie and I are away on a little holiday. We are going up to Fort William for a night and then we're going home for a few days. And if some of you don't know, Edinburgh is not my home. I do live here. Um, but Elgin's kind of like more my home. So we're heading up there for about a week um, just for the summer holidays. Originally our plan was to go to Sky, but that kind of fell through a little bit. So instead we're just going to go to Fort William for two days and yeah. Let's grab our toothbrushes. Put them in the box. I've already got toothpaste. The floss. My beautiful skincare stuff. My favourite face wash at the moment is the Purifying Palmarosa face face wash. This stuff's so good. It's by Neil's Yard Remedies. I need to put it on the lock setting. Let you go. All right, I adore it. Can you please just go on the back? Great. And the Rose facial wash for scent, normal to sensitive skin. Um, that stuff's lovely. Um, I've also also run out of this stuff and I'm really really upset because it works miracles. It's the Honey and Orange Facial Scrub by Neil's Yard, Neil's Yard Remedies again. Um, this stuff is magic but I've run out. I'm trying to like use up all like the little last bits like inside it but this guy's kind of dead. I think I'm kind of holding on to it too long. A razor because she's going to be hairy. I'm not going to bother packing my shampoo and conditioner because I've just completely run out. I just need to get a different one. I'll pack Stefan's. So we're currently at Asda. I just went and got some fuel. Stefan's just going in to get some snacks. Um, after this, we are going straight to the Devil's Pulpit just outside Glasgow, which is about an hour and 19, hour and 20 minutes drive away, which is fine. So I've got some fuel. He's getting some snacks. Um, I went and like, it's roasting it's really hot we think it's like 23 degrees and for scotland that's pretty hot like, let's be fair here we're so used to like just rain constant rain <laughs> so i've got this huge water bottle i got from primark and i've just filled it up with ice because i just i drink so much i drink so much water i need to or i die I actually die so I'm just waiting on him to come out of Asda with the snacks and then we can get going. Snacks! I don't care that you hurt your elbow. <laughs> what? What's next? What's next? Right, so we feel up. Snack hole, snack hole. Chicken bites. Ooh. A selection of sweets. Mm. Laughing Cow Dunkers. Oh, yeah. Chocolate chip cookies. Nice, nice. Uh, they didn't have any cheese or ham only sandwiches, so it's a cheese and ham sandwich. No, I don't know. Um, Doritos. Nice. Looks good for you. Oh, you angel, yeah. Looks good for me. You the best. That's it. You're such a good boy. <laughs> right, ready to hit the road? So we managed to get to the car park at about 2 o'clock and I locked the keys in the car. <laughs> I'm laughing about it now but I was so close to tears and it took two hours for a really lovely family to help us out and it was this older gentleman that basically just kept trying and kept trying and kept trying and he got it he managed to break into the car i was following my uncle who owns a garage and everything it was a mess it was one hot mess and now we're just finally heading off to 
The devil's pulpit. The devil's pulpit. That's amazing. Get some bomb ice pictures down there. How do you get down there? That's the thing. Yeah, just steps, there, yeah. steps? Okay. about five o'clock now and we're just at Balloch Castle and um, we're just gonna stop off and just see what this place is it looks really pretty just park the car I think Steph's gonna have a bit of a go on his drone um, we were gonna take it to the pulpit but we've not used it yet so that would have been a bit of a disaster I know they're quite good for not crashing oh this place looks cool It's really beautiful here. I could do it for castle. You could do it for castle? Yeah, I could do it for castle. <laughs> yeah, this is totally my scene. I can see myself living here. <laughs> just you know waking up on your castle and looking onto your castle grounds and seeing you know just Loch Lomond no you know it's the Loch just Loch Lomond waking up to you take the high road out at the low road on your for your alarm every day just put a state in the legs absolutely minging <laughs> Stefan now setting up his drone if anyone's wondering, the drone we got is the DJI Mavic Air. Um, we've got it on finance at the moment. Um, we tried to find second hand, but they just snapped up so quickly. Oh my god. The summertime is coming, and the trees are sweetly blooming, and the wild mountain pine grows around the blooming heather. Will you go, lassie, go, and we'll all go together. To pluck wild mountain thyme All around the blooming heather Will you go, lassie, go I will build my love about Near yon pure crystal fountain And on it I will bear All the colors of the mountain Will you go, lassie, go And we'll all go together To pluck wild so we've just stopped on the way to Glencoe. Um, I could have had a bit of an outfit change because it's really uncomfortable. I've got Stefan. I'm rocking um, Nike. St 
Stefan's um, shorts and my bra and a jacket because it's a bit gusty up here and um, it's absolutely gorgeous. Wait till you see this view. Holy shit. And this is literally just a taste of what Glencoe is going to be like. How beautiful is our home? You stunner. I'd give Scotland about an 11 out of 10. Huh? <laughs> so we're just setting up the drone. We came all the way from there, along here, and then up. And then we're going all the way through back that way again. Because you can get some of the bony shots with the drone. This is absolutely stunning. So we drove like all along the side of Loch Lomond. And, oh my god, it was beautiful. But somebody decided they would just go 40 miles an hour on a 60. And I was like, <laughs> I, have, I have no patience for anything. And that was driving me insane. And eventually they turned, they turned in and I was like, thank God I can actually go 60 on the 60. That was really annoying. Let's see how this turns out. It's a bit windy, so we're hoping it will be okay. If my true love, she were gone, I would surely find another where wild mountain tide rolls around the blooming heather. Will you go, lassie, go, and we'll all go together to block wild mountain tide. All around the blooming heather Will you go, lassie, go And we'll all go together To pluck a wild mountain tide All around the blooming heather Will you go, lassie, go I look minging. Absolutely minging. So we just stopped through Glencoe. It's absolutely beautiful. It's definitely got some more drone shots. Um, I went rummaging around in the glen and in, in the heather for a place to take a fish. It's difficult because all the big rocks are actually kind of small rocks and there's a guy back there just standing having a wee tea break and I'm like can you move on so you know I can just squat one down that'd be great yeah we're we'll gonna head back through we head off to Fort William I don't know what's happening with our accommodation I think I have a really feeling in my gut that we're not actually gonna get in either that we just drive home from there or we see if we can find somewhere else we can for cheap. Charge slots if we come late at night for our room. Yeah, I'm hoping Let's just someone will be there. Try and get there. And yeah, so it. we're just gonna head back off. <sighs> I'm tired now. You can probably see from like, the start of this vlog, just my transition of going to looking like okay with lashes on and everything, to now, <laughs> where I'm like all red in the face and like so oily and sweaty. Just about to jump in the shower. Um, our room's okay, it's just a classic little student room, We're just again hired out. Where's the light? I've got to be a light. Oh. <laughs> 
Here we go. This bathroom. Hello, it's me, Megan. And the shower is cozy, it's nice and small. Like me. I'm so tired. Okay. Got a lot of colour, we've got a bed. It's one of those three quarter size beds, isn't it? Yes, a bit small and big, you think. Is it actually? No, the same size, I think. So. It's very squeeze. Yeah. Dougal's parked over there, bless him. I'm absolutely knackered, that was a lot of driving, not gonna lie. And we didn't even think we were gonna be able to get in here. So when we were sat outside, and Stephen's like, we're just gonna have to drive to Elgin. And I was like, I'm not doing a whole tour of Scotland in one day. That's a lot. But we made it. Right. And now we're tired. Do you watch Love Island? Yeah, we, we, we need to catch up on the rest of Love Island. Um, I forgot shampoo and conditioner. So we're going to have to get up early tomorrow and get some. The checkout's at 11, so I'll need to get up earlier and just wash my hair. But my body's absolutely minging. So yeah, that's, that's the tea. Catch you tomorrow. Stop, you're so awkward. Stop. Stop my phone.